Hi guys, Pete from Mixcat. Today we're going to make some uh, barbecue ribs. This is uh, pork ribs. What you do first is uh, cut them up, trim off any excess fat, so they're pretty clean looking like this. I cut these guys in half. Um, I'm going to put apple cider vinegar on it. The apple cider vinegar is actually going to open up the uh, pores of the meat. That way we can apply a rub. Um, I'm going to put this in the oven for 265 uh, degrees for about two hours and slow cook them. Uh, after that we're going to finish it on the grill. Alright, just going to put a little bit of the apple cider vinegar on the bottom, just a couple drips here, not a whole lot, because we are going to put a, a barbecue sauce on it. There we go. Just kind of rub that into the meat and do both sides. And again, this really helps you get the flavor into the meat. Rub that in, and now the other side. What guy doesn't like ribs? Perfect for the barbecue, very cost effective way to feed the family, friends, neighbors if you, you got them. Okay, next we need to put on the barbecue sauce. And we're just going to do that kind of generously on the top. We're also going to need a liquid in here. And I'm going to put beer. Um, I'm going to put almost a full beer into it to allow this to slow roast and not lose its moisture. This is just a standard uh, smoky hickory brown sugar uh, barbecue sauce. Sometimes I make my own, but for the sake of time, I can't do that today. Next ingredient is some sea salt. Just going to sprinkle a little bit of that on top too. Again, to help break down the meat and give it some flavor. Alright, we got the beer. And that just goes over the top just to keep this nice and nice and moist. This is what uh, when it cooks real slow in the oven is going to keep it absolutely tender and break down the meat even further. Kind of like a, a almost a light simmer to a boil inside going on. There we go. I put a little bit of garlic powder on the top and a little bit of black pepper and this is going to go into the oven for about two hours, 265 um, maybe a little bit over two hours and we're going to finish that up on the grill with some extra barbecue sauce. Okay guys, just going to check the progress here. It's been in for about two and a half hours on 175 degrees right now. I started off about 250 and I kicked it down an hour in. That's looking perfect. You can see the, uh, the meat's coming away from the bones and that's going to be full off the bone good. Um, Probably in about another hour, I'm just going to pull this out, dress it with a little bit more barbecue sauce, and finish it on the grill. Here's a closer shot. Just flip these guys over and look at the bones peeking out. This is going to be super, super tender. I'm just going to dress the other side a little bit here. Just give it a little bit more barbecue sauce. There we go. This is going to be great on the grill. All right, we're about four hours later. Look at that. Just going to put them on the grill and sear them up. See the bones are popping out already. Going to be tender and delicious. Wow. Mmm. 